my god. Hey guys. <laughs> so embarrassing. I don't know why I'm doing this video. But this is what my eyes look like. I was rubbing them. It burns and itches. Ugh. I took off all my makeup like hours ago, but there's like residue on my eyes still. And sometimes it'll irritate and I'll just like rub it. And I rubbed it for the sake of this video too, but this is what it looks like. I just put, um, like Visine and like this inside my eyes. So definitely take care of the inside of your eyes first. That's my first tip. I'm gonna go to bed right now cause it's 1.11 a.m. And I'm pretty sure my eyes are gonna look like this when I wake up in the morning. And by that time, I'll show you my life hack. Cause if I don't do it, the swelling is gonna go down in like two days versus like an hour. So I will catch you in the next clip. But right now, beauty sleep. Okay, so I'm fully awake now. Eyes, like I said, are still swollen. Like, look. Does that look normal to you? Uh, yeah, not cute. But anyways, um, on with my life hacks. So what I start with, um, you really only need two things. Um, witch hazel and I looked this up and I just basically found any like what do you call it um anti-inflammatory like topical stuff um and witch hazel is natural so you can get this anywhere at like any convenience store in like the skincare section like Target, Walmart, Long's Drug, CVS. So I just take like a little cotton pad and then just stamp in the whole thing. Make sure it's like saturated. And then get one of these um, jade rollers. Um, this is us usually for using to like depuff your skin. You can also get this at like TJ Maxx or Target too in the skincare section. This is supposed to like depuff your face because in the morning your face like holds a lot of water retention so it's puffier in the morning and when it's puffier and you leave it like that, it's said to like um, promote more like wrinkles. So if you do like gusha or whatever and push all the water out, it should depuff. Um, and I just decided this is pretty much the same thing. Like I could use it on my eyes, so <laughs> that's why I decided to use it. Um, dampen I just flipped it over make sure to dampen both sides just kind of make it completely saturated just put it over your eye I'm gonna start with this one I'm gonna just take the small side and then it's hard to do with one hand but just like roll over it and then half of the time I'll do that like roll it over and then Half of the time, I'll just directly roll over it and just push it out. You can do it this way. You don't have to like really push the life out of your eyes, but just enough pressure. And you can do this for maybe like 20 minutes. I don't know. It shouldn't take that long. Yeah. And that's it. I'll get back to you when it's on.
it's been about 50 minutes, I think. Um, I can tell because on this video when I'm recording on my phone will tell me what time I took this video. But you can see it's pretty much, I would say, 90% there. My eyes are back to normal. Um, there's a little puffiness there, but... Um, for the most part, I can lift up my eyes, because this morning, like an hour ago, I couldn't. Yeah. It's pretty good. I basically just flushed out all the fluid that was built up in here.